You mentioned sort of 17, we're all sort of at that same, you can't have that much differentiation That's probably between the people so around quick. you. But 30, it's a little more calcified. Yeah. Do you think there's an, a cutoff age? I don't mean exactly a number, like you're gonna say 56, but do you think that there's a point, and, and there was a question asked at Clemson where uh, somebody said to you, you know, you've really helped my 60-year-old father who had all this stuff going wrong in his life. He started listening to you and he's, he said he's, I think she said he's in the best place he's ever been yeah. or something. But do you think that there's a cutoff age where just physiologically, you can't quite do Well, I do think a it gets harder, because yeah. you get more who you are as you get older. You know, so there's not, the ratio of actuality to potential starts to shift. But, but it doesn't change the, the underlying simple truth, which is there is definitely something that you can do today that will make you slightly better for the next day. Always. Always.